Welcome back. Let's take a look how this post fader system works with Air Windows console plugins. If you want to know how to install this system, please check my previous video. First, let's activate the script. Go to Actions, Show Action List, Post Fader Insert, and run the script. Insert Post Fader Start and End plugins on the channel. Insert the Air Windows console channel plugin between the Post Fader plugins. It's probably a good idea to copy these plugins as a channel strip, but I'll just manually copy them for now. Finally, let's insert the bus plugin in the master. And there we have it. As you can see, when I move the fader, the output of the post fader start plugin changes. level output to the console plugin. I hope you find this useful. I'll go through some further examples how to use this system in upcoming videos.